Today I'm going to show you how to cast your PC or your Mac to your Chromecast through screen mirroring or casting from an application. Let's get started. The first step is to download the Chrome web browser on the Mac or PC. You can do that by going to google.com forward slash Chrome. If you already have Chrome installed, you need to go and make sure that you have the latest update by going into the settings and selecting update. So once we are in Chrome, all we need to do is go up to the top right of the screen. And here we will see the three dot menu that will pull up our settings. So if we click on there, and then here we go down, we will see the cast option. When I click cast, here it says cast to, then I have the different Chromecast options as well as audio options. When you click this drop down. You can choose to cast the tab that you are using or to cast your desktop. So we're going to start with casting the tab. And here I am just going to send what I'm looking at to the Chromecast Ultra. That's the device that I have here on the TV. Here it is casting the tab. And anything that I do on the computer, you will see that it mirrors that over on the TV. If I'm watching a video that doesn't have Chromecast support, I can see that all on the TV. If I want to stop casting, I can go up to the cast icon in the top right hand corner here. And a few options I can do is I can right click on this and I can click this always show icon. So that makes it so this icon is always available and you don't have to click the drop down menu. If I click on that, I now see more options where I can change the volume as well as stop casting. So here I'm going to select stop. And now I have ended that cast session to the TV. So now I want to change this from cast tab to cast desktop. So now again, I have the same Chromecast options. I'm going to click Chromecast Ultra. And here on the share your screen pop up, you do have the option to share audio. Now this is only available on the PC and not available on the Mac. Here I click share. Now you see I have the full desktop on the TV. If I minimize Chrome, you'll see that I have access to my desktop and all the applications down here. So I can pull open my file browser and see everything all on the big TV. If I want to stop mirroring my screen, I just need to go back into Chrome and come up here to the cast icon, select it and say stop. Now, if we go to a cast enabled website here like YouTube, you will see this cast icon when you are watching a video. So now from my PC, I can click the cast icon. It will show all the Chromecast options here. I'm going to say Chromecast Ultra, and now it's going to play that video over there and I can continue multitasking on my computer. So while that is playing, if I want to watch another video, on my Chromecast, I do have a play now option or I can add it to the queue and it will play that video after the current video finishes. To stop casting, go to the cast icon and select stop. When you're using a Mac, you have the same options. Here at the top right, we click the three dot drop down, and then I need to select cast. This will then give me the options to cast to my Chromecast. Again, I can click the drop down, cast tab, or cast desktop. If I select desktop and Chromecast Ultra, here you just have the option to share your entire screen or other applications that you have open, no audio option on the Mac. And then I click share, and now that will send my desktop to the TV. When you are using any website, you can also right click and choose the cast option as well. And then you will receive the options to cast this to your Chromecast. I hope you enjoyed this video about using Chrome on your PC or Mac to cast your Chromecast. If you have any further questions, please leave a comment below. And if you would like to see more videos like this, hit the subscribe button as well as the bell icon that pops up so you can be notified of my new and upcoming videos. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one. In today's tutorial, I'm...
In today's tutorial, 